I'm here today with the Makeup Forever. They just sent out this huge, huge, huge thing full of the new Aqua Pencils XL. And because spring and summer are coming up, I thought that what better thing than like waterproof liner pencils because I know that in the spring, summer, I am out swimming at the lake. I am outside a lot. It's hot, it's sweaty. You're jumping in the pool, jumping in the lake, the ocean, whatever. And if you're like me, I do tend to wear some makeup. I was really excited about these. I am going to be putting some to the test in a waterproof video. I've seen a few different people do it on YouTube and I think it's a great idea. I am writing down a list of products that claim to be waterproof and we're gonna put them to the test. And don't you worry, these pencils are going to be one of them that are in the video. So I'm going to show you guys swatches just in case you guys were interested in picking these up. I know that a lot of people have been posting them on Snapchat and Instagram and stuff. I haven't seen any videos of these go up, so I thought I would jump the gun and do some swatches for you guys. So let's get to it. So I know the regular pencils, their aqua eyeliners retail for about $19 on Sephora. I'm assuming these are going to be around the same price. I don't see them on Sephora yet but I will make sure to link them down below when they are. They may be up on the Makeup Forever website, but we're gonna just jump right into it. I'm gonna let you know my thoughts as I swatch them, and we're just gonna go. This one is in, I'm gonna zoom in a bit. Oh, this is lovely. All right, so the first one is in uh, M10. This is a matte black, and I can always love myself a matte black. You see that? Very, very black, very creamy. We're gonna smudge these out too as we, as they dry a little bit. This one is in D12. This one looks like it is a sparkly black. Ooh, these lids are on tight. Oh my goodness. There we go, we're good, we got it. Okay, so this one is D12. Yeah, they're so creamy. This one actually looks very, very matte. There is the finest micro glitter in there. But that one is D12. This next one is M14. This is a matte. This one also looks like a dark charcoal color. Yeah, nice dark matte gray. That's really beautiful. It's very, very creamy. This next one is a white one. This is matte 16. I don't have very many white liners. Yeah, that's pretty dang creamy. This is S20. This looks like a really pretty blue gray. Um, there we go. Yeah, that's pretty. So this one is a, actually a deep blue and it has a little bit of a sheen to it. So that one is S20. This is M22. This color just looks so stunning. Really beautiful, kind of brighter royal blue. So that one is M22. This is I24, which I think is their iridescent one. Yeah, that's pretty. It's got a nice like metallic sheen to it. So that one is I24. This next one just screams spring to me. This is M26. It is a really pretty bright sky blue. So that one is M26. This is M30. Super intimate, okay. What happened to mine? Oh, it's stuck in the cap. There it is. Hate when that happens. So mine was broke, let's try to fix it back in there. That's what it should look like. Uh, this one again is M30, that's a gorgeous mint color. Like a Tiffany blue mint, love it. it is I32, this one's an iridescent Ooh, teal, that's so pretty. So that one is I-32. These are incredibly creamy. This one is I-34. This is going to be like a metallic green. Yeah, that's pretty. I-36, this looks like an antique gold. It almost has a lot of green in it, that's pretty. I think that's a great fall color. This is M-40, I definitely wanna do a look with this. Beautiful, light, a light pale yellow, love that. We also have ME42, so this is gonna be a metallic one, I'm sure. Yeah, that's beautiful. Do you see the reflection in that? And I'm sorry, I'm looking in the viewfinder, I'm just making sure that these are showing up. This looks awesome, this is S50. It's like a taupe color, like a stone. 
Yeah, I would call that a stone color. So that one is S50. M60, which is a brown. So I'll start right here. Really nice chocolate deep brown. Here's a metallic -y brown. This one is D62. And we'll swatch it over here. Let me get that better. So this one has a little bit of a sparkle, but for the most part, it looks pretty matte. So that's D62. So the next is M80. This is a matte purple. I'm trying to figure out places to swatch here. Oh my gosh, do you see how creamy these are? They're so creamy, and I just totally broke the tip on that. I think I pressed a little too hard. This one's gorgeous. This is I-90. It's a sparkly purple. Like a little bit of a brighter purple. That's really pretty. And then the last one I'm very excited about, it's a lavender, and this is in M92. So pretty. Yeah, that's a very beautiful lavender. So I think these are great. They are, you do have to sharpen them. They're not retractable. Uh, but I think the color range is really beautiful. And now let's try to smudge them. Look at this. I'm pressing very, very hard. Look how hard I'm pressing. And look at that. It's like not even smudging. Um, let's go to this one. Look at that. These are very, 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 like it's, it's there. Look at that. That one is like the newer one that I swatched. It's barely smudging. Look at that. This is crazy. So when these set, they set. I am so excited about these. Here's a wet wipe. These are, this is a makeup wipe. Let's see how easy they come off with a makeup wipe. Okay, they, this was a bad idea. <laughs> okay, so this is a Kirkland makeup wipe and it is taking some serious effort to get this off. So I am so excited about these. I think they're going to be very long wearing. They're gonna be great for the spring summer months for being on the boat, being at the lake. If you like to wear um, eyeshadow, or if you like to wear liner or you wanna do something fun, maybe you have a long day, maybe it's a wedding. Um, I think these are gonna be so fantastic for um, staying in the water line or smudging on your upper lash line or lower lash line. I'm really, really excited about these. So if there's any specific colors you wanna see in a tutorial, let me know. I'm also, like I said, going to put these to the test in a waterproof video coming up here soon. And yeah, if you guys are picking these up, let me know what colors you liked most. I really scrubbed my arm and I've gotten most of them off. But these are no joke. They're very, very long lasting. So really excited about these. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I just hit my in the face. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, leave any requests down in the comments below and I will talk to you guys later.